How to install Ladacrete Spectralock 2000IG Grout Ladacrete Spectralock 2000IG is a highly chemical resistant industrial grade epoxy grout for ceramic tile, pavers, floor brick, packing house tile, and stone. Ladacrete Spectralock 2000IG is for use in corrosive environments such as industrial food processing facilities, canneries, distilleries, pharmaceutical factories, veterinary hospitals, clinics, kennels, commercial kitchens, and fast food restaurants. It exceeds ANSI 118.3 for epoxy and ANSI 118.5 for fur and grout performance requirements. Ladycrete Spectralock 2000IG is also easy to install. Before beginning, be sure that you have all the necessary components. Inside the Ladycrete Spectralock 2000IG number 2 unit you will find 2 part A liquids, 2 part B liquids, 2 part C powders, rubber gloves, 4 packets of cleaning additive for your water, and the instructions on how to install the grout. You will also require additional grout sponges, working pails, and plenty of clean water. White vinegar can be used as a substitute for the initial and final cleaning additives. Pour Ladacrete Spectralock 2000IG Part A and Part B in a clean mixing pail and mix thoroughly with a drill mixer until liquids are completely blended. Compared to traditional industrial grade grout systems, Ladacrete Spectralock 2000IG has high chemical resistance, improved temperature resistance, and very high physical strength. It inhibits the growth of stain causing mold and mildew in grout joints with microband antimicrobial product protection. It has a high resistance to bacteria attack. It is water cleanable and fast curing. Add all of the Part C powder. Whip the mix thoroughly for a minimum of 2 minutes with a high speed mixer at 450 RPM or more until uniformly blended. This will aerate the grout to a very fluffy mix. Before starting to grout, remove spacers and debris and grout joints and remove dust and dirt using a damp sponge. Allow to dry. Substrate temperature must be between 45 degrees Fahrenheit 7 degrees Celsius, and 90 degrees Fahrenheit 32 degrees Celsius. Add the initial wash cleaning additive to 2 gallons 7.6 liters of clean water and mix until fully dissolved. For maximum pot life, remove all grout from the bucket. Spread the grout with a sharp, firm rubber grout float. Work the grout mix into the tile joints. Ensure the joint is filled. Remove excess grout from the face of the tiles with the edge of the grout float. Hold the float at a 45 degree angle and pull it diagonally across the face of the tile. Once the grout has been spread, wait approximately 15 minutes at 70 degrees Fahrenheit 21 degrees Celsius, prior to beginning the initial cleaning. Wipe grout joints and tile surface with a white nylon pad in plenty of water using a circular motion. Smooth the grout line, making them uniform and even. Drag a damp clean sponge diagonally over the scrubbed surface to remove any grout residue. Rinse the sponge often for the best workability. Use each side of the sponge only one time and make sure to rinse the sponge each and every time you wipe the tile. Wait at least 90 minutes at 70 degrees Fahrenheit, 21 degrees Celsius before starting the final wash. The 
grout line should be firm and the tile dry with a dry epoxy film. Prepare another two gallons of clean water and add the final wash cleaning additive and mix until fully dissolved. For the final cleaning, use the same procedure as in the initial wash. Scrub the tile surface with a new damp nylon pad to loosen any grout residue. Drag a damp clean sponge diagonally over the scrubbed surface to remove any grout residue. Use each side of the sponge only one time and make sure to rinse the sponge each and every time you wipe the tile. For additional information, visit our website at www.latacrete.com.